spend it reflecting, pondering, changing something. Like Aisha radiallahu anha asked the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and we've said this before, if I were to see or witness or be fortunate enough to be in this night of decree, what should I do? What should I say? He says, say, Allahumma innaka afuun tuhibbul afwa fa'fu anni. Oh Allah, you are most forgiving. You love to forgive. So forgive me. So if you achieve forgiveness, it's amazing. It's the biggest achievement you could ever have from the month of Ramadan is to be able to have the blessings of standing in worship during the night of decree, even for a portion of the night. Not every one of us can stay awake all night, every night. Yes, not, not every one of us can stay awake throughout the night on any night. There are some people who need their sleep. You may, but keep it minimum. It's sunnah to liven the entire night. But if you really are a person who's unwell or you need that sleep, Alhamdulillah, it's not wrong. You may do so, but at least spend a portion of the night doing something special. Is there not something special you're going to do? Going to read a page of the Quran that you don't normally do? Going to read a little bit more today? Going to engage in extra acts of worship? Subhanallah, something to please Allah, give a charity maybe. Make peace with someone, family members, and many others that they may be. Promise Allah to change your bad ways and habits. Any one of these beautiful deeds, the reward will be multiplied so much that Allah says this night is better than a thousand months. Subhanallah. Imagine Allah's given us favor. We have read like Nuh alayhi salam, for example, it is said he lived with his people for 950 years and lived beyond that even more. And we have lives that are between 60 and 70 years plus minus. The average lifespan is far less than what it was then. So Allah is doing you a favor if you have to witness 10 nights of decree throughout 10 years or 10 Ramadans, it would be more than 830, between 830 to 840 uh, years of ibadah and worship. Can you imagine? It brings a smile to the face. MashaAllah. May Allah's blessings shower upon us always. Amen.